Salutations, my friends, and thank you for joining us again as we play Lamia Must Die. A horrible monster has been terrorizing the local town for years, doing terrible, unspeakable things to the citizens. One day, a paladin leads several other heroes toward the cave where the monster lies, them being the final hope for the town of Clearmill and to save it from total devastation. This is a free-to-play RPG, RPG Maker type game, available for download on Steam. Now, it does have some mixed reviews, but overall I enjoy the art style, and it has some very excellent voice acting. So let's play, shall we? Now here we find the main menu screen. We have a few options. Resolution, to continue, but we're going to go ahead and start a new game. Now I do like this, it's your classic RPG menu screen where you can change the colors, a few volume options. We'll go ahead and turn down the background music just a bit. And we will change the battle style to turn-based. That way we can more painstakingly agonize over our inevitable death. And return to game. The Blitz is ADQWSD. Now that is interesting. I hope I don't have to actually push those buttons in that order because that looks tricky. Here we go. Press F5 to change from window to full screen. Press F6 to change resolution. You only need to do this once. Your settings will be saved. Skip the intro. The once no. peaceful town of Clear Mill has in recent years been plagued by a horrible monster known as Lamia. Many soldiers have gone to try and defeat her, all of them dying in the process. As the people of Clear Mill are ready to abandon all hope, a paladin arrives into the town. Who was the paladin? Eric or Janet? I think we're gonna have to go with my bro, Eric. Eric was a paladin who fought using a sword and shield. He was very sturdy and was able to withstand mighty blows, even though his heavy armor slowed him down. Is this correct? Yes. The paladin was with a great bishop who had worked with them before, the two complementing each other's powers. A rogue seeking revenge for her lost sister joined the fray. Two other heroes also wanted to help, but who was the fourth heroine? Ursula or Vivian? I'm actually not sure. Let's check them Ursula both out. Ursula was a mage, knowing many spells that could hinder numerous foes at once. And she has wings. Is this correct? Who was Let's the see our second heroine? option. Vivian, Vivian wielded a mighty bow that could hit any single target with incredible power. Is this correct? Who was the fourth heroine? I think we're gonna have to go with the magic Ursula user. Was a mage, knowing many spells that is this correct? If I know anything about very hard to win RPG battles, is that you always need magic, especially healing. Let's go ahead and take party her. Decided, the four heroes make their way towards the cave where Lamia rests. The fate of Clearmill hangs upon the shoulders of our four chosen heroes. Let's go through the plan once more. Tomorrow, we'll enter into the Heart of Darkness. I thought the plan was just to attack the monster. If only it were that simple. I've faced enough monsters to know that things are never as simple as they seem. I heard that she used to be a beautiful woman before she became a monster. Who cares what she was? My blades thirst for her blood. When I see her, I'll gut her like a fish. I like her already. Is right. We mustn't let rumors about her stray us away from our mission. Too many people have already died. I agree on that. I don't really feel like my name added to her list of victims. Yes, but I was just wondering if we could reason with her, appeal to her humanity. And then what? We let her go after all that she's done? Well, Never. Uh, when you put it like that... At ease, Brenda. We don't want to fight amongst ourselves. We'll have a hard enough time as it is. I want to kill her. 
for what you- And I don't want any of you to stop me from doing what needs to be done. This is it, vile monster. For years you've been terrorizing the small town of Clear Mill. All those poor no children. What when my children were taken from me? When a jealous goddess made me kill them! And turned me into a monster for having her husband love a mortal instead of her! So now, I hunt and devour the children of others to down my sorrows with the blood of my victims! You're insane! Just because you've suffered gives you no right to kill the innocent, who never did anything to you! As a royal paladin, it is my sworn duty to erase the world of the likes of you. But I know alone I could never be a match. Not to something like you. However, after a long time I was able to find people strong enough, whom could help me defeat you and end your reign of terror. Ursula, the Mistress of Flame. I heard stories about your grotesque appearance. Even still, it is very troubling for me. Truly, you're as evil as you're insane. Jonathan, a bishop with the knowledge of smiting evil. You've killed so many innocent people. Today your reign of terror ends! And last but not least, Brenda, a rogue who lost her sister because of you. I've waited for this moment so many years. Today, my blade shall taste your blood. Now, foul monster, it is time for you to die. So you wish for death? Very well, there shall be death! I will slay you all and feast on your remains! Such a foul being. Time to die! Here we go. Alright, we have an attack, a special, a guard, and some items. Now it is set on turn base so we can take our time and check things out a bit. We have a healing brew, antidote, a booster, a shaman drum, an eternal candle, the essence of god. Oh wow. We have a miracle elixir and a revitalizer. I think I want to go ahead and use a booster. I'm hoping this will boost our stats. Maybe this will help. Oh wow. Very anime style. Now we have guard magic special and attack let's see what our magic we have curse armor slow down tongue of flames fire geysers life drain and divine curse let's hit her with the life drain good shall triumph let's go ahead and use a booster I feel on my you as well. pain. Let's try one of our specials. We can coat our blade in poison. That might be useful. Let's go ahead and do that. This is my destiny. All right. Our special attacks. None of those look any good. What about our magic? Healing light and annihilation cross. Let's try this one out. This is for my sister. 127 is not so bad. Now she does have a poison blade now. So let's try out our normal attack. Only 60 damage. Let's try the shaman drum. Let's see if this good shall triumph. And let's see what our normal attack does. Feel my pain. Zero. Yeah, this is pretty bad. We need a way to check these spells before we use them, because we are helping our enemy instead of helping ourselves. She is now regenerating and healed, so this is going to be very bad. Let's try a meteor shower. Surely this one is going to do some damage. Try already. 
Ooh, quite a bit of damage. But, uh, she is going to heal some of that damage back. This is for my sister. And we all took a pretty solid hit there. Let's go ahead and use some of our healing potions. Healing brew. Maybe this will help. This is my destiny. You're still doing pretty good. We don't need to heal you. Let's see if we have anything decent. The super guard. Let's go ahead and do that. He now has iron body. And let's hit her with the slow move. We can slow her down a bit. Alright. Bless weapon, silent prayer, or saint. Let's try the saint. Awesome, it healed everybody. Now that's going to be an important spell in this battle. I need to remember to use that one. Vanish, unnatural luck. Let's try the sweet luck. Feel my pain. And we get another attack. Now she is poisoned. Let's try blessing our weapon. Actually, let's bless Eric's weapon. Some fire geysers. Oh no. And we didn't make it in time. That one's gonna be hard. You gotta remember to hit those buttons. Let's go ahead and try the Assassin's Edge. Ooh, quite a bit of damage there, and she's poisoned again. Now we are all out of special attacks. Let's try our Miracle Elixir. Oh, that was bad. She is going down fast. Let's go ahead and get her a healing brew. Have a drink. Much better. He's going down as well. Now he has... A healing prayer. Let's go ahead and try that one. Not too bad. The Saint's probably a better spell, though. Let's hit her with the Tongue of Flames. Okay, this one's much easier. No damage. It actually does nothing if you don't get it in time, so that's pretty rough. Let's hit her with a normal attack. 74. Feel my pain. And let's hit her with a sweet kick. Signs of vanquish evil. We now have provoke. Healing light and annihilation. Let's use the healing light. She's on Brenda. I shall cleanse the evil. Alright. She's now regenerating. That's actually really good. And we will use the saint one more time. Alright, everyone is back. Hit her with some more flame geysers. Oh, wow, that thing goes so fast. Let's go ahead and try our unnatural luck. Now I'm not sure if that's on a timer or if you get her down to enough HP, but it looks like she's going to summon some things. Snakes. It had to be snakes. Let's go ahead and focus on these snakes. Let's kick this snake in the face. Cleanse the evil. And the snake is stunned. Now let's go ahead and shoot the stunned snake. Or no, let's go ahead and try to take out this one. That one's no longer a threat. Alright, we need a spell that can damage both at the same time. But we do not have one. So let's go ahead and take this one out. Mm. 
All right, we got it in time. Only 146. Look like you're still stunned over there. Let's hit you with a basic attack. Well, these snakes are tougher than they look. We'll go ahead and kick you in the face again. All right, both snakes are stunned. That's really good. That attack is useful just for the stun ability. Try to focus on one snake, see if we can get one out of the picture. Alright, that sped her up quite a bit. Fire geysers on the right snake. Alright, we got it. Awesome. It's one of those hit everybody attacks. Let's kick the snake. We can keep it stunned. This is my destiny. And we'll go ahead and attack this snake. Almost gone. This is for my sister. Oh, that was nasty. Go ahead and finish this one off. I will smite thee. Ooh, that's a tough snake. We're still doing pretty well. Actually, let's go ahead and heal her while we have the opportunity. Magic time. This. Time to die. Awesome time critical hit. And another attack. Might be. Let's just focus all our basic attacks on the snake, see if we can take it out quickly. Now he is really weak on a basic attack, and he is really strong, but that actually makes sense. He's a monk. He's a knight. And a ton of flames on the snake. Time to die. We will go ahead and pause the game here. And I'll continue in part two. Once again, thank you for joining us, and I hope to see you next time.